Okay, here we are on the online whiteboard. As you have probably figured out, I love to draw out diagrams. And I started doing some research about nine to ten months ago. Read a lot of different surveys. Actually even conducted my own survey with um, thousands of people on my email list. And asked them the simple question, how did you find and locate your last job? And combining those percentages with the other percentages of some of the wider ranged which wider range surveys which asked hundreds of thousands of people the same question here's where the numbers fell and I think this is real insightful and helpful for you 8% said that they found theirs uh, attending a career fair 12% through the newspaper 22% from online job boards but the big one is 55% said that they found theirs through networking. And so when we put together our action plan or our game plan this week, it's going to involve over half of it is going to involve networking. So basically for ever for every one activity that you do when it comes to networking is an activity that you pick one of these and I won't go into all those details right now but keep this in mind networking is what is going to produce the high value activities that you need to perform and I'm going to give you the specific steps and strategies here in a little bit but basically I've boiled networking down to two there's online networking and there's offline networking online networking refers to the internet uh, it uses social media like LinkedIn is a good one, Facebook, Twitter, some of these others. Offline networking is going to be the old build the company names, find out who you know, call and talk and get to know people, that sort of thing. And we're going to kind of dive further into it. But just remember this, like I said before, if you want to get into these hidden positions, then you've got to get yourself further down into this job search value cone. That's where the success is. In other words, right here, as you can see, I've put visible. Because again, this line represents, like I've mentioned before, think about the iceberg. Uh, here's an iceberg floating in the water. And this is the tip of the iceberg. Most people get frustrated in their job search because all they see is what they see right here. And guess what? this area right here is where the competition is so you've got less competition when you get down into these activities down here this is where all the action is all the the competition all the resumes that are being sent this is all the reactive people is what I call uh, these they're reactive if you want to get proactive then you gotta get yourself down into here here's the people that are performing a lot of this are just kind of performing random actions but we're gonna help you develop that game plan and I'm gonna give you some specific tip, tips in the next video on the next video I'm gonna specifically talk about online networking so go to the next video I hope this is insightful for you keep this in mind we're gonna work on high value activities and you're gonna get yourself further down in this job search value cone because that's where you're going to have the greater chance for success.